Welcome back to Performance TV. The last time Jake from North Star Performance was on the show, we talked about improvements to the top half of the engine, including a patented head stud that eliminates head gasket problems. It was a great deal, and there's going to be a lot of North Stars back on the road that were having head gasket problems, even improved head gaskets. This time on the show, we're going to talk about the bottom half of the engine. Jake, what is the common problem, and what is your solution? Well, basically, a lot of these engines, they start to leak oil over time. And the issue with that is you had rubber seals that would shrink. And as with all rubber seals, it's not really just a North Star problem. It's a common automotive issue. The only thing is North Stars scare people when they get into the bottom end. There's three layers of seals. You've got this seal here, the case halves. You've got an oil manifold plate that has to be replaced every single time you work on one of these because it has an embedded gasket in it. And then you have the oil pan seal itself. And then you have your front and rear crankshaft seals. So all of that can be re replaced usually without any issues, but the odd time you will run into it where a main bolt will either snap in the hole and you'll have to replace that, or what you'll end up with is stripped main bolt threads. And the solution for that is, well, as we did on the top end, an oversized stud. Now the North Star is a dual overhead cam V8. We're getting a great look at the bottom end. The stud or bolt holes are actually used as the oil galley as well. That is correct, yes. There is 12 of these main bolts. Oil is actually f fed down the shaft of the bolt and then into the back of the bearing journal there. And it feeds the bearings and it also feeds the rest of the engine through, through those passages. The odd time you'll get a, a bolt that snaps or you, if you uh, take the bolts out, um, just the design of the bolts, I, I'm not exactly sure what, what it is about them, but they do crack. You'll actually see, sometimes you'll see a crack in the threads. And if you don't see it close enough, you go to put that bolt back in and it snaps upon torquing, you'll end up taking the whole bottom end back apart just to get that out. And if one of these bolts lets loose, you'll actually have oil bypass the head of the bolt and you'll lose oil pressure and that's something you don't want. We want to keep these cars on the road. We've got the bottom end here. Why don't you put it on the engine block? And while we do that, thinking about the solutions to the problems, I know there are a lot of shops out there that are looking for solutions. Sometimes they might strip out a uh, head bolt and try to go to an oversized bolt. Sometimes they might drill out the bolt hole, go to an oversized bolt, and decrease oil flow. That is correct, and that is something you do not want to have happen. It's very important to stay with the OE diameters, and we do have this main stud kit. We actually have it available both in standard size. You know, it's a good idea to go with studs anytime you're dealing with fasteners. You know, anytime you're going to be getting more even clamping pressure, a um, lot less chance of thread failure, especially in aluminum. And so we have the, the standard size. We also have the oversizes I've shown you here. What you can do is you, you can mix and match these, um, but it is a good idea if you're going to drill and tap one hole out, do them all, um, put our oversized main stud set in, and then you'll be bulletproof. You guys have got some great solutions. Why don't you put the bottom half sure. on the studs? And while you're doing that, I understand you have a list of performance shops or shops that you work with on a regular basis on your website. That is correct. Yes, we, we worked with a, a lot of shops across the United States, some in Canada, some overseas. Actually, you'd end up putting the oil manifold plate on here before you'd nut these down, but we're just showing this as an example. Uh, but yeah, we've worked with a lot of shops that, that have experience in the North Star that have they've found out about us, about us, they've found out about our product, they've used it, they've got solid experience in it. So we've listed them on our website for people that can't bring their vehicles to us or don't want to do it themselves. We can at least get them to someone who's very competent with these engines. So we have that list growing. I mean, there's, there's thousands of shops that used to work on these engines, but they gave up because, you know, the, the issues that they had with them. So we always want to add more shops to that list, make it easier for people to get their Cadillacs fixed. We have to keep the North Stars on the road. You've got reliability and you've got performance with a PCM. And for more information, you can check out the website, 